We've got a leak, everybody, and this time it is for Scuderia Alfa Tauri. Now we know that they are going to rebrand. I think that's been in the news headlines for a while now. A few names were thrown around, but we have seen a new logo appear, which has been what it looks like to be trademarked and registered by Red Bull. So here it is, Racing Bulls. Now this has been going around Twitter and various news articles. And you know what? I've got to be honest actually don't mind it. Racing bullshit. Now that's probably what I'm going to think of. And you know what? I want to talk about Hugo Boss who were actually uh, speculated and rumored to be involved with AlphaTauri in the future and be a sponsor for the team, Toro Bosso. Now look, if it was up to me, I mean Toro Rosso is for me my favorite. I know that a lot of people kind of liked that brand it made sense, I think. Having really good liveries as well, I mean, it helps people like to connect with a brand, and I feel like we could all do that. And I'm sure those who had a bit of a soft spot and supported Minardi were probably a little bit disappointed when it was renamed to Toro Rosso after the Red Bull takeover. Now, racing bullshit. Very interesting choice of a name, but to be honest, as I said, I don't mind it. Yes, it wouldn't have been my first preference, but I feel like this is going to be a little bit strange next to the Red Bull name. I feel like they're just too similar. Like we know that they're both connected teams, a sister team, but I think these are just a little bit too close. I mean, I feel like it's going to get confusing to some people. Maybe newer fans might get a little bit confused. You know when you're trying to explain F1 teams to like your friend that doesn't really know much about the sport? One of the things you let them know about is Red Bull and Alpha Tauri. Red Bull is the main team and then you have Toro Rosso slash Alpha Tauri who were, you know, that sort of avenue for a young guy to get into F1. It was their sister team. So now you kind of have to say, okay, Red Bull have another team called Racing. Bullshit! I don't know. I feel like there might be a little bit of confusion. Maybe not for, I guess, regular fans or fans that have been watching for a very long time. I feel like it's just so ingrained into our minds. Red Bull is its own thing. But to be honest, I never really got around Alpha Tauri. I just couldn't get around them. First of all, I didn't like the name, but I think with Alpha Tauri, first of all, people didn't even say it right. A lot of people were saying Alpha Tauri, which if people kept saying that, George Russell would have handed in his transfer request. <laughs> now, I know Red Bull are a marketing company, so of course we were going to get a new brand refresh sooner or later. And to be honest, I don't know, I might be on my own here. I didn't really like the liveries. Now, I like the white and I like the blue, but I feel like they never came up with one that really stood out. I feel like Toro Rosso had some bangers, some iconic liveries. Now, I actually have a conspiracy here. I think this rebrand was caused by Sergio Perez. I think Sergio Perez said, hey, Christian, you're not going to demote me to Alpha Tauri, are you? And Christian was like, of course not. <laughs> Wait till we tell him about racing bulls. Speak to my drivers. Look, I'm just saying, okay, it's just a theory. But either way, I find this exciting. Now, the colors do sort of look the same as Alpha Tauri, of course. But, I mean, if it means a new livery, a new rebranding, I feel like we might get something cool. From a livery point of view, I mean, it's something to look forward to, of course. And even if the name is Racing Drivers. But I feel like a lot of people don't like this already. I think a lot of people just want Toro Rosso to come back, okay? I was disappointed when that name left, and I think I'm not alone there. I've seen a lot of people online saying, why don't we just go back to Toro Rosso? It was perfect. Everything about it was perfect. It was an Italian name for a team who has their factory in Italy. The DNA of Minardi, it all made sense. But, guys, Red Bull are a marketing machine. And you know what? They do everything for a reason. So let's just watch the show unfold. Anyway, I wanted to talk about this today. I thought it was pretty interesting and I wanted to get my thoughts out there. Let me know what you think about this potential rebranding. Is it going to be confusing? Do you not mind it? Do you think it should be Toro Rosso? Because it should be. Feel free to follow me on Instagram for some behind the scenes content and future video sneak peeks. If you enjoyed this video, I'd really appreciate it if you hit like and subscribed. As always, I truly appreciate your support and I will see you in the next one. Drivers.